the funny thing about God and people who claim to be Christian is how they often believe that that statement gives them a pass of something. The truth is it doesn't. It makes you more visible for sure, but other people are evaluative and they're going to look at you and go, really? I'm not seeing that. You see, every version of Christianity is met with every version of perversity. And the truth is that God can only function in someone who's willing to submit their life to God. In my case, I have submitted my life fully to the Lord in almost everything I do every day. But I still have those moments of, I want to be in control. But what I realized was that God is in control. The hard part is that God is not in control of enough people. What I mean is not in terms of him operating people like a robot. What I mean is that, that people don't submit their lives to the Lord. So they start to try to play lords over other people. They try to play gods in other people's lives. They totally cross into people's boundaries and do stupid things that end their lives. You see, the minute you step out of your own life and start focusing on someone else's life as if you're in control and you're going to fix this and you're going to do this, you've already lost your life. You've given up your abilities to see yourself. You see, people are always longing for love, but the saddest part are about the people who have everything and then they don't really have love. But then they think they find love, but it's a falsity. And the falsity is a person is full of perversity and not the type of things that God wants for you. You see, when you hear God say no, then you need to really listen to that no. Satan doesn't always say no. He says, go ahead, do it. In my lifetime, I've never loved an individual as much as I love my wife or the woman who came after. And openly, she came alongside in those moments of time. And God had a plan for me and her. But every human being around her helped her to be ruining herself, literally destroying herself with God. So while I'm a hitter for the Lord, she's a misser of God.